So this is just a quick video on how to make your oil paints dry faster. I've got some linseed oil and some cobalt sicative that's been sitting in here for like two or three days and you can see that this oil is actually a little bit um, it's thick, right? It's hard to see here but you can kind of see how it stays on the brush like that. It's a little bit thicker than normal and that's because the cobalt sicative will actually um, it just thickens it over time and it's starting to basically dry it out. Um, one thing to notice though when we look up close at how we mix with these colors is see how this is a little bit stickier? It's really hard to get it through the uh, through a video but you can kind of tell that when you're blending with this It's got a very thick, almost syrupy is a good word to describe it. When you let linseed oil and cobalt sicative sit for a while, you know, out in the air, like in something like this, it starts becoming kind of maple syrupy. You can kind of see that here, I hope. Yeah? Um, I'm going to show you how to, how to prepare this. It's very simple. I kind of like painting sometimes with the older linseed oil, but you'd have to basically figure out and just do it, you know, two days before to get this really kind of syrupy, it's almost like stand oil um, effect. But I'll show you how you just start off with it, and when you first start off with it, it doesn't affect your paint in any way. And uh, if you have these things together on your paint, you can see this was painted yesterday, this stuff. See this? See how dry this is? This is oil paint that's one day old. Yeah, and all I did was add a little bit of sicative to my uh, linseed oil. So let's back up the camera here. Here's our two, two things we're using. Uh, linseed oil. And here is the cobalt sicative. And it's a really simple process so simple that there almost shouldn't be a video for it but what the heck everybody has to learn somehow I've got to clean this out so for this all I'm gonna do is take some linseed oil and I'm gonna put it into my little linseed oil pinch pot thing here nice pouring good job yeah and then with this you got to be careful by the way always be careful with these materials. There's stuff on here that says like it burns and probably is bad for you so don't mess around with this. Um, and for this it's pretty simple straightforward again. Obviously it's kinda of difficult to pour so all I do is I take a straw and I just dip it in there. Yep. And that's like all that I have in my straw. I don't know, yeah, that you can see that, right? That's all I have. It's like two drops. And that's all you need. You just drop it in. Boop. Stir it around a little bit. And that's it. You're done. Um, drying time should be, I'd say, max when you're using this. Maximum two days. And your oil paint will be as dry as this. I have to clean my palette now because this stuff is so so dry. But um, yeah, good way to do it and uh, if you like these sort of tutorials and stuff you know head over to paintingcourse.com and start taking the course and painting. Start painting! See ya.